In this video, I'm going to cover how to do the 3.2 nominal level histograms homework on a laptop or desktop. The process would be similar on a uh, smartphone, but you'd be using your finger. The part one is just make a histogram of these most frequently occurring names um, on the uh, crown of the, uh, of the of baby names born in 2018. Click on the chart wizard here. I don't want a pie chart. I just want, and that's it. That's part one right there. They counted the baby names. Uh, push that off to one side. There we go. I'll drop that over here for now. And in part two, I want to, this, this data, the number of babies, column F, is the frequency data. All I need to do to complete this, these aren't true histograms in that technically histograms the columns are supposed to touch but I can't do that from here and at the nominal level this is as close as we can get to the histogram and these are the number of babies versus the uh, baby name and that's the part two uh, histogram and that's really all there is to that particular homework is those two histograms histograms are made easy uh, by uh, by um, by uh, Google Sheets because it is an option. Notice that on part one I did use the histogram chart type. Part two I already have the frequencies. Imagine that I have something that looks like part A but I have in that table 19,837 liams, 18,688 emmas. That's the number of babies born in 1918 that were given that name as their first name. Uh, 19,837 times some pair of parents looked down at that baby boy and said, oh, Liam is such a special name. And indeed, it will be special in five years in some ECE class when there will be 19,837 Liams flooding into those classrooms. Uh, but uh, lovely names all. And those are the top names in 2018 in the United States.